I developed EDS and POTS within the year that I got the vaccine and my heart health has been in steady, rapid decline. I really urge anyone who thinks mRNA is safe to really think about why you think restructuring DNA is anyway safe or healthy. mRNA, particularly mRNA in COVID vaccines, is not restructuring DNA. In reality, every single one of your cells is producing mRNA at all times because that's how you make proteins. In order to do that, DNA is converted through a process called transcription into RNA. And that RNA leaves the nucleus. That's a one directional process. Then it hooks up with a protein complex called the ribosome, where it's converted into an amino acid sequence that then folds into a protein. So in the case of the mRNA vaccine, that vaccine contains the mRNA sequence, in the case of COVID vaccines, for the spike protein. That RNA hooks up with the ribosomes, and our cells create that spike protein, which then our immune system mounts a defense against. So nothing ever enters or approaches the nucleus where our DNA is located to even change the DNA. People who still believe that the mRNA vaccines can change DNA often cite this paper from 2022. They look at the ability of an enzyme called line one, instead of going DNA to RNA, it converts RNA to DNA. And they say that the mRNA in the COVID vaccine is being converted into DNA. They never show that any of that mRNA ever interacts with cellular DNA. But beyond that, they're using a liver cell line, meaning these are cells growing on a piece of plastic, and these are cancerous, meaning they are not behaving normally, and they express this reverse transcriptase enzyme, whereas our healthy cells do not. So this model isn't biologically plausible in the way that these vaccines work in our bodies. No other studies have shown anything similar, and we have orders of magnitude higher data points with actual human clinical data to show that mRNA vaccines are not changing our DNA, and they're safe, and they save millions of lives.